I'm Johnny Ray for Effort Nation News at Mid-Ohio. Just completed rounds 11 and 12 of the Pirelli World Challenge. And with us right now, we have the two winners. It was a sweep for Effort Racing this weekend. The number 41 driver, Michael Mills of Effort Racing in the GTA car, as well as Ryan Dial, number 31, the GT winner. I'm going to start with Michael. Congratulations, first of all, sir. Thank you very much. Recap this extraordinary weekend. I mean, I, all I can say is we had two wins, double-double, both of us. I, it's, there's really nothing else to say. And, and uh, you know, I've gotten more points for that championship. Um, we, we got it back yesterday, and, and we've stretched it a bit more. Uh, so we'll, we'll take all the points we can and pat it so we uh, just get through and get this championship wrapped up at the end of the year. There you go. As we look to Sonoma, what's your outlook for that? I'm not real sure. I've never been there. You know, I had the benefit of, of having been at Mid-Ohio, and, and I've been at Miller. Uh, so I guess I'll uh, as much simulator time as I can get for Sonoma, so I at least know which way is right and left. So, we'll, you know, the, it's going to be the same strategy. Go out and win. Extraordinary job. Congratulations, sir. Ryan Dial, number 31 GT overall winner, two times in a row for this weekend in mid-Ohio. Tell us about your weekend. Yeah, I mean, we, uh, we couldn't have scripted this better. Uh, you know, part of my job was uh, – Trying to help Michael with the championship. Obviously, I'm not. I'm not here for points. I'm here just to uh, to get race wins and trying to continue to build this amazing team with Effort Nation. But uh, yeah, I mean, it was uh, yesterday was difficult. Today was uh, even more difficult, in my opinion. It was hot conditions, but our uh, Porsche GT3Rs were excellent. Uh, I think we both are really happy with the balance of the cars. And you know what? It's like I said, it, you, you can't script it better than this. And uh, in racing, I've been in it a long time now, and you have to really enjoy these weekends and. Uh, Sure, we're going to all go have a few beers tonight and uh, reflect on uh, what I would call perfection. Absolutely, and speaking of perfection, we're looking forward to having you for the rest of the season, sir. Am I correct? Yeah, I guess I passed the audition, so uh, <laughs> that's cool. Um, no, I'm, I'm super excited. You know, it was uh, big shoes to fill coming in after, you know, a really great weekend from Nick Tandy. And, uh, you know, it's not easy when you come into a new team mid-season, but uh, everybody at Effort Racing has made me feel like uh, like I've been here for two years, you know, and a uh, great bunch of guys, great teammate with Michael, and a phenomenal job he did in the GTA class. But, uh, you know, like I said, you come in with uh, with good people around you, and that's what it's all about in racing, and we got the best people here at Effort Nation, and uh, looking forward to the next two races. Sonoma, I have been to before. I've raced GTs there a couple of times, so, um, you know, Michael and I will we'll do our homework there like we did here, and... Uh, We'll keep these Porsches up front. Absolutely. Congratulations to both of you. Thank you. Appreciate your time. Thanks very much for having us. All right. Of course, four wins for Effort Racing in Mid-Ohio, rounds 11 and 12, with the Pirelli World Challenge. Effort Nation, join it. Go to EffortNation.com and reap the benefits. And stay tuned for more Effort Nation news. <laughs>